for me it was a, it was a good three days for the, for the guys. We have uh, a lot of things in the room, also in the field, and now is the final final session here in the film. Everybody has his own question, his preparation, and now he show us what he can do with his goalkeepers. Yeah, the role of the goalkeeper is very important, and the role of the goalkeeper coach is important. I, I hope that in the, the years that are coming, we have more and more goalkeeper coaches everywhere, in all the levels, not only in professional level, and like this we can do the work with the goalkeeper will be better. I finished my exercise, I asked for my children to come back with this movement. Okay. It's been really informative, uh, learned quite a bit from it. I think the most important thing is um, they've actually taught us how to really coach and make goalkeeping fun for real young kids. Uh, because that's sort of the challenge we have back at home is that you get all these kids show up for soccer practice and not a single one of them wants to be a goalkeeper because you know, basically all they do is at the end of the training session is everyone shoots balls at them. Uh, yeah, this workshop's been great because we've learned new skills, new activities, new exercises that we can use, make goal goalkeeping more fun rather than it just being the kid that stands in goal while everyone shoots at, at the end of the practice. Looking down. You need pass, look up. Okay, pass, look up. For us, it's to to keep these uh, guys and uh, involved on the pitch and. Uh, I think we will organize a new one next year, level two, and from that we can start to uh, to train instructor to deliver uh, MA course. How valuable has it been having someone like Alexander Vincel here with you this week? Um, like you know, Alexander is a former national goalkeeper from Slovakia with I think 20 caps. Also, he played uh, more than 400 uh, games in professional level in France. It's uh, very valuable for all of us. Uh, coaches but also for the FC technical staff. In the exercises, every time he's here, moving, very good presentation. Congratulations, fantastic. Okay, very good. Yeah, hopefully um, I can go back. Uh, we've got a few uh, youth uh, coaching courses coming up with the new youth coaches we're trying to develop and bring into the system. I'm hoping that maybe when that course comes up we can probably allocate maybe a day or two and sort of pass on some of this knowledge so that the youth coaches can go back into their clubs and we can start targeting these kids at a really young age because right now we're sort of leaving things a bit too late in terms of the technical skills we need to teach them.